So recently I noticed I have this insect bites on my shoulder area. I'm starting to believe I might have a bed bug problem. All right, so today we're at the Home Depot trying to look for some insect killers repellent. They have a wide variety to choose from. Actually, it's located right here. So many choices. Last time I even bought some of these. So lately I've been dealing with insect issue. Basically when I'm sleeping, I feel that house flies are landing on me. So basically I've been going by sleep for three days. So today I'm cleaning out my mattress. As you can tell my mattress is off the box springs. And what do you know, right off the bat, I noticed this bug which resembles a millipede, not exactly a bed bug. What do you guys think? It's kind of like tannish stripes with brown head and tail with many legs, kind of like it has whiskers on it. So basically, I went to Walmart and I bought one of these hot shot, make sure I get rid of the bed bug and flea issue, especially since I have a dog in the house with Akira, many, even carpet beetles too. It could be a possibility, but that does not look like a carpet beetle, maybe? What do you guys think? That's the size of it. Here's my pinky size. So it's relatively small. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to flip it over so you guys have a better look at the underside. Kind of looks like a maggot on the other side. Oh, that's so gross. Yeah, so basically what I'm gonna do is remove my box springs and then I'll spray it with this strategically along the, uh, the foundation of my bed. From the footrest, I mean the headrest to the footrest. So wish me luck. So for the directions, what I'm gonna do is spray it. In between the seams, I'm gonna start out with the headrest in between the seams. <laughs> along the cracks I don't really smell any odor it's neither pleasant or stinky oh wait a minute it smells like Raiden now exactly do the same for this side and the directions also say do not saturate the mattress and box spray Remove the bedding and wash the bedding with high temperature and dry on high heat. Do you guys think that it might be infestation of bed bugs? That's one way of getting rid of it. One thing good. I like to do in addition to using the hot shot spray is to just remove the mattress and also the box springs. And to use my vacuum cleaner, just run it through the bed area to pick up any debris. Um, larva, eggs, bed bugs, or fleas. After I'm done with the carpet area, what I'm gonna do is also the vacuum, the box springs, and also the mattress. So let's get started. <laughs> Directions they say to allow it to dry before putting the mattress back onto the bed. So right now I have uh, I bought some brand new linen sheets and also three piece comforter set just to make sure you have something new to work with. You know who knows some uh, bacteria or bed bugs might have gotten into the sheets or the comforter. So he decided to roll with these. All and right, so here's else. what the new sheets look like. It looks so silky smooth. I can't wait to sleep in there. It doesn't hurt to just buy brand new shoots and pillowcases and comforters. Who knows? There might be bugs hiding out in there. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Take care of yourselves. And have a good night's sleep.